Hey everybody, welcome into video 67 in the Mediocre Risk series. Uh, we are playing some classic fixed tonight on my Wade Fujita account. This is my uh, original account. Um, this looks good here if they'll let us in. Uh, Wade Fujita is a grandmaster. This is the first time I'm playing uh, in the new season, so... I'm sitting exactly at 26,000 right now with the, the point reset. So hopefully we'll be able to win this classic fixed battle and uh, move up in the points a little bit. Uh, I try to play classic fixed on Mondays. Obviously that didn't happen this time. Um, but you are getting some classic fixed. And we will see what we got. All right, so we got some interesting blizzards. Well, one interesting blizzard. Don't know that I want South America. I mean, I love South America, but don't think that that's necessarily the best way to go. Africa's pretty full also. Queen's going first, though. I don't really want Australia, but... Gosh, it sure looks like Australia is the place to be. Uh... Oh, Forest Green is hitting my two. And fortifying where? He would like some Africa, it looks like. Blue doesn't go until afterwards. We don't know which direction blue is going to go. Do I even have an easy card anywhere? I mean, I would have to hit this. My easiest card is hitting this red two down here, which I definitely do not want to do. Ugh, is orange going to open anything up for us? It doesn't appear they will. Well, they bought it instantly. This is going to end up being a waiting game because blue could totally smash this and take Australia. Which way is orange going to go? There are just a ton, a ton, a ton of troops. You like card skipping. Hitting a two is usually worth it. I don't know that I want to stay in Africa, though. Ugh. All right, we're going to hit the two. Hopefully I don't lose too much here. I only lost one. All right. Um, We're going to fortify all the way back up here so that I've got an out if blue or green wants to really fight about it. I assume red's going to want South America. They're not going to clear the whole thing out on the first try, are they? Oh. At least try to take a card elsewhere. I don't know that I would have gone for that two-on-one first. I would have tried the three-on-one. That obviously didn't work. So he's going to have to hit a two to get a card as well. But instead, he goes for my three and doesn't lose any. You might as well finish it now, man. I only got four left to hit. He could be sitting on a really pretty one-point hold there. I'm not sure what Red is thinking. Gustav Sneedcroft. All right, Green is General the Tyrant. Aisha Sane. Striker Kuo. And ice the sly. Yeah, see, I was assuming blue is just going to take this, even if they don't stay there. They've got some really powerful positions here. You got the Australian position already. What it does do... Hey. Excuse me. Keeps green from pushing all the way into Africa. They can put troops in there, and they can start to take it. But they can't do anything about it. All right, so yellow, wow. What did they lose on that? Yellow lost four to take two. Oof. But they clearly want Europe. Uh, does that mean nobody's going to fight red? Orange needs to go after him there. There's nothing for you over on this side of the board, Orange. You need to start working your way back to North America. Oh, 
Where is green gonna go? Try to take a card in South America. Interesting. Oh, they did it. I'm gonna try and do the same thing. Where's orange gonna go? I just don't see what my path is to winning here. I'm already down to 14. I've got a super small stack. Everybody's taking my stuff out. I mean, if I don't hit that two on one, I don't even know where I get a card. Mm. I promise I'm not actually that tired. I have no idea why I'm yawning so much. But I I just don't I don't see any way out of here. Maybe I card skip to make myself less attractive to someone who might want to kill me. I mean, they all go there. And then we try this one. Come on, big number. Didn't get it. Do I even try to take a card at this point? I think we're just going to skip. I need cheaper cards. I don't want to look attractive to someone who's trying to take me out. No one's going to want to take out 16 for 1 at the moment. I don't know why you didn't do this last turn. You missed out on the two the two card bonus there. Red's doing really well. Blue's in a pretty good position. He's in such a good position, he's not even consolidating. Or is he? Oh. He's trying to isolate red? It's interesting. He's just going to keep going. Keep hitting red. Get red stuck in North America? At least I've got another place to take cards now. Maybe green will come out? I'm really worried green's just going to go into Africa and I'm going to get stuck. Orange is the one who should be fighting red, but doesn't appear that they have any desire to do so. Yellow just keeps stacking in Europe. Oh, he's coming back. All right, he's going to give Red something to think about. That's helpful. It would be really helpful as if Green leaves Africa. Oh, Green, you are my favorite person in the whole world. Maybe Orange will follow suit and get those troops out of there. Make me the happiest person on the face of the earth. Orange is moving right along. Okay. Um, so we're going to stick some troops down here. Try to get our card right there, which we barely did. But we are still alive. We are under much less threat. I'm hopeful that Orange will do something for us. Red's just building up over there. Blue could have done some offensive moves. They've decided to consolidate everything. And just play the game out of Australia, which is not necessarily the best move in the world.
yellow taking a card and stopping. They've decided to consolidate up in Greenland. See who's going where. Green turns in early. Does that mean they're not going to come from me? They're going to go after blue? I guess it's not early. It's when you can do it. But they're not really in any danger. And it doesn't appear like they have anything that they need to take. And they're not even putting anything... In. Oh, are they going to try and kill me? They are going to try and kill me. You have got to be kidding me. Yes. All right. Um... So that really stunk. There's a lot of good players in that game. I don't feel like I started out in a great spot. I'm not sure what else I could have done there. Um, so we're going to just try and play one more while we're here. Um, and see that game is no longer available. All right. Uh, I thought that was the game I tried to get into. Okay, we do not want to be pink. I'd love to be green if we can get there before it gets started. All right, so we're still a Grandmaster until the game is over. We're adding a bot. Interesting. All right, so we're going to play green. Wade Fujita. Classic fixed. We're now, I mean, what do we say? The score on the road. No longer a Grandmaster. I'm going to actually lose quite a bit by going out first in that last game. Um, you can put in the comments if you thought there was something I could have done. Now we've got two bots in this game. Awesome. Okay. All right, we got alliances, so we're going to make alliances with everybody. Wait, we've got three bots? No, two bots. And I have three human opponents. All right. Black is going first. I am green. I am all over the map here. And again, I don't have a particularly easy card. Gah. So it would allow me to put troops into Europe, though, which I like. That five should be relatively safe over there. You know, South America is not an easy hole. This is two bots fighting each other in Australia. Yellow doesn't have an easy continent. Black doesn't have an easy continent. White definitely doesn't have an easy continent. We are going to take cheap card. Um, and then I think fortify down here. So I'm not sure. Just know that I've got a much better chance in this game than I did in the last. Oh. White's going to take a card. Oh, there's a one up there. Okay. So they're putting in in North America. Red's getting the big kahuna. Which direction are they going to? Are they going to go for Europe? They are. Okay. So I guess I maybe move my troops into Africa? That's not ideal, but might be where we need to end up. Mm. 
love to get that five out of Quebec, but currently there's no real place to do that. Um, black pudding in in Europe and since all right, black doesn't appear to know what they're doing. They're playing this like it's progressive. It's not progressive, right? We are on classic fixed. No, I got a one up here with this four that I can go after. Where is this purple bot going? All right, that direction is good. Get the five up there. I think white's going to want me to get that four out of the way. So where's the yellow going? Yeah, I think moving that four out of the way is going to be a good, good bet. Hmm. Yellow's making the play for Australia? Or they're protecting the kills? Both bots are in there. Curious. All right, so we're going to take our card up here. Um, and then move that together. Really do need to start getting our troops into the same place, but I think the five is still safe in Quebec. I mean, white wants North America. I've now given them a chance to get their four in if they want to. Not yet. Okay. They're going slow with it. That's fine. The bots dictate a lot anyway. Is that going to hit the four? It's not. It's going to hit the one. And then the two? Oh, it's going to just keep going. Wow. Okay. Now, where is black going to go? They've been spreading the love all around. He's going to try for South America now that he's got purple hitting it up. And it's away from the bots. Purple's coming back at him. That's going to just hit the two. Smart move. Smart move. And purple didn't take the four out in Australia, so nobody can go for that. Unless yellow just does the whole thing. He's going to go one at a time, right? No. Man. Is he going to hit that red four? He is not. All right. I can't really get blue. I mean, purple. And I don't think I actually want to. I think we are just going to get into Europe here. Ah, oh, didn't lose any. Love it. Love it. Okay. So we're making a little claim on red. I can't trade in yet. But I've got 27 troops, which is looking pretty good. I assume black is going to take South America on this next turn. Trade could get me purple, but I don't know. He's keeping a stack over there. He's gearing up for taking yellow out. That's kind of fascinating. 
There's not much of yellow left. I didn't even think about going after one of the human players so early. Black's trading in now. Are they going to try to take purple out or not? Looks like he might. Is he going to put seven there? Ooh, I don't know if six is going to be enough. Oh, he got that one. Oh, he missed it. Oh, no, he got it. Oh, he got it with the four. Right. Okay. Is this neutral? No, it's not neutral. It's automated. Um, yeah. If I could trade in right now and take black out, that would be awesome. Yellow's the one, though, aren't they? White knew it. White's protecting that kill. Very smart. I don't necessarily want to do anything to help them. Yeah, we... We weren't going to try and take a card up here. And I'm actually going to move this back to give myself some flexibility on the next turn. And hopefully, even if red turns in, they don't come after this nine. I'm taking a risk not moving it into Africa, but I'm feeling okay about it. Does white want to take out yellow? Oh, they don't have the trade. Oh, I have the trade. I do have the trade next time. Oh, they hit him. And they're not going to get it. Now the question is whether yellow has a set or not. Okay, red. Red's got 20 for four. That's definitely doable. Is black going to try to do it? That would be an overreach for black. But it would be interesting to see. They're just fortifying their position. Oh, and they're moving out of the way for me to get red. If I want to. I like that. Does yellow have a trade? Oh, they don't. Oh, no. <laughs> they just didn't take a card? Huh. Okay. Um, we're definitely trading in. And what do I put here? Ten. We're going to go for it and see what happens. All right, so we got red. I don't know if that was good for us or not. 
but we do get another trade but I don't think we've got enough to do much of anything so we are going to bring as many troops back to the middle as possible we're going to see if we can keep Europe I don't know if Black's going to want us to do that but we have the same number of troops as Black and one extra card and we made it harder for White to take out Yellow What are they hitting? Just a bunch of territory? That's kind of curious. Oh, they're going to let black take out yellow. They're just feeding them. Why? They're feeding yellow to black? Why would you do that, white? sort of insane. Now they're going to come for me? I mean, black's going to take out yellow. Get all those cards. Trade in. What are they going to do? They're going to come for me, I guess? We've been homies. We should go after white together. Oh, why would you break my continent? That's not cool. Okay. We're going to just sit here, see if white attacks me. Guess that's the plan. I can trade next turn, but so can black. And they're just going to take me out? I got the 12 blocked. He's going to go hit Iceland. Okay. This guy doesn't know what he's doing. Ugh. Which means black is definitely coming after me. He's got to try and kill me. I think he can do it. Yeah, I mean, if you're black here, that is the absolute right move to make. Oh, yeah, lock some troops there. Put them all there. Oh, excellent. Okay, so he's going to break me, but he's not going to kill me. We can live with that. And he opened me up to go after white. We're just going to stick. I got a better bonus. Black keeps breaking it, but... They seem to be passive. And white doesn't know what they're doing. He's trying to take Asia. I think that's what he's going to do. If he breaks me, I definitely just go smack him. But I think he's just slowly trying to take Asia. Which is kind of beyond ridiculous. Oh, Black's mad at me now? 
Why would you not go after White? Because White is an idiot. I get it. He's bringing a bunch of troops up there. Okay. Uh... <laughs> What do we do here? I guess we hit this and then challenge. I don't know. I don't even have a trade here. I hope Black doesn't have a trade on three or I'm toast. White's just sitting over there. He's going to take Asia. And then hopefully Black will do something about that. Should have gone off somewhere and hidden because white's going to be dumb enough to make black notice them. Hopefully black doesn't have a set on three and they'll go smack white. Okay, so I will go up here and get out of the way. I still think black's going to come for me first because white is an idiot. But there is an off chance that white will do something so stupid black will have to go after them first. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess there's a chance Black can take me out. Oh, they don't have a trade. All right, so I'm going to be very unappealing. Okay, so we are going to get out of the way. Up here. Like this. Yeah. So I've only got two cards. No reason for black to come after me. White's actually the strongest player on the board right now. And they're going to continue to try to take Asia. Which I just find magnificent. He's going to take all of Asia. Maybe Ukraine. And he's going to sit that 20 stack there, isn't he? This is insane. Oh, my word. All right. Black's going to trade in. Are they going to hit the 24? Where are they going to go with this? He's just going to hit the... Well, I thought he was going to smack that 20. He's just taking all the territory and opening them up. And then 
right back where he started. Well, I don't want him to be closed off to white. So I am going to take Africa. And fortify up here. Patience is a virtue. So white trades in. He's upset with black. Is he going to take all of Asia back? Is he going to just smack that thing into black? That's what I want to see. He's just breaking the continent I have. And turtling. Well, that is no fun. What is black going to do with that? Black's doing no fun. Okay. Ugh, I still can't trade. Is white going to try to come after me? Is he just going to get everything back together again? No. He's just going to keep being a jerk. That is truly unbelievable. Well, now he's closed off from me. So I'm not, definitely not. Gonna open that up, but I don't know if Black will. So I think Black's just taking one at a time. Yeah, we are. Taking a card and passing. That is what we're doing. Now, black may come and take me out here. Ugh, I've got a crap trade. All right, because there is, you know, a world in which black takes me out here, but then I don't think you can win. Oh, although white just cut off his stack. So maybe black does take me out here. And then just relies on overwhelming force. What are we, what are we doing here? I'm going to be ambitious. Oh. I'm going to be ambitious. I'm going to try to partner with Black to kill White and see how Black feels about that. Because white now has their troops locked. They could come break me, I suppose. Oh, not from that direction. We'll see if black decides to break me. 
I want to team up with them to take out white. It does not appear that black is interested in doing that. Am I too weak for them to be a partner? Or is he just going to try and take me out? It makes sense for him to take Africa. That's for sure. Is he just going to sit there? Is he, he's going to destroy me? Because he thinks he can beat White after he takes out my 47? Really? Okay. Well, I guess I get third. I don't understand the logic of that. I mean, White is incredibly dumb so maybe he thinks the extra cards can be helpful that's a lot of troops though he's got to beat there's no point in really taking much more maybe just Middle East I mean White's not going to be able to break very much Especially if you move that 11 to Ukraine. I mean, Black was not playing the most aggressive, you know, logical style to begin with. Man, and White is just even worse. I think White is almost certainly going to lose. Well, there's no reason for it at this point. I mean, he's going to broken a couple of those continents and then moved 50 out to be a scare stack here. I mean, if White's not bringing the stack out. They're just digging themselves a hole. Yeah, I'm not going to finish this. Uh... Man, have those games not ended yet? All right, yes, I'm already down to 24-122. Oof. All right, so not a Grandmaster anymore. We're going to try one more for this ultra-long video uh, and see if we can't show you a win. You know, the skills that actually got us where we are in the first place. Oh, we got a bot there. Let's get rid of the bot. Please remove the bot. Yeah. There are blizzards. All right. So we are playing with a bot here. Five player. I get to be red. Wade Vegeta. This is the color I like to be. Um, you are going to get to see three classic fix games all at once. This is the bonus for not having one on Monday. Uh, video 67 of the Mediocre Risk series. Oh, oh is this a three-bot game now? Oh, man. All right, so purple is real. John Kipper and Tyler Pridum. Okay, really unique blizzards. Who's a bot? Right, I've got a decent shot at Europe here. Oh, man. Oh, a bot's going to give it to 
Give Australia the yellow, though. Okay, so we... I'm going to put one here. I'm going to put the rest over there so none of the bots gets any ideas. We're going to take that and move over. I mean, the advantage here is that all of my troops are kind of in the same place, which is good. Purple, do they want to take Africa? They're going to have to hit bot pretty hard to do that. All right, so you got a card over there. Orange gets to go for the first time. He's putting most of his troops in Africa. All right, so that's going to mess with purple. Is he going to keep coming? He's not going to roll the four on three. White is another bot. That's not helping. I need blue to get nice and strong down here. Yellow's got to decide if he wants South America or Australia, and he wants both. Greedy little bugger. John Kipper, 25. He's not taking Australia on this turn, though. Okay. So, where is blue going to get a card? Oh, he's... He did it! Wow. Rolled the six on six in order to get a continent. Very interesting. Yellow is now in rough shape. He's going to be stuck in Australia if he doesn't watch out. Okay, we are putting troops over here. And then our card is going to be down this way. And we're going to fortify those together. We got two nine stacks and a four. I like it. I like it quite a bit. Purple is seems to be my only competition here. So I'm interested in what he's going to do. He wanted to go for Africa, and Orange put a bunch in there. Which basically blocks off this 7. Okay. Can you do a multiple attacks? He's not. Okay. He's playing really smart question is, is that going to hit Madagascar? Oh, Egypt. Okay. So both of my opponents have taken really big hits. So yellow has got to take Australia at this point. That's really his only play. Blue's got South America. Is he going to put troops down there or not? He is apparently not. I was hoping he would hit Mexico. He's going to get him next turn. Is white going to move out of there? All right. None of white's troops went that direction. Oh, man, they are going after purple like nobody's business. I am loving this. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess we put those over there. And we don't worry about any bonuses just yet. We get our two big stacks. 
sitting where we can use them. Got a really nice big trade here. Oh, what did you do, Purple? Lost three. Is he going to keep going? He's not. Okay. Where are the orange troops going? Creating a nice little buffer for us. Yeah. I'm liking this. Where are those 10 going from blue? Um, none of them into South America. We are taking yellow out or oh, purple. Oh. Man, do I just take purple out on this turn? I have to get four, five, you have 10, 11, 12. I have 17 up there. Yellow is the one it would make sense to take out. Yeah. I think that's the play. Right, because then I get four cards there. And I have a little bit of a bonus, potentially. Does purple trade? They do not trade. Okay, so they're going to be sitting on four. I think blue takes out Central America here, and then I can take them out of Africa, and then it's only me and the bots left. <laughs> I think regardless, I take them out of Africa. Ooh, that's not the way I want this to go. I want blue to hit Central America here. There it is. Okay, finally it's going to happen. And then I will take purple out, and it'll just be me and the bots. And that should be an easy cleanup. going kind of hard after blue to figure out who to take out in what order uh, I'm going to save this because I think that's all I'm going to need to take out purple of course if I fail I'm in deep doo-doo but that is not going to happen Okay. Now we take out orange. Ugh, gotta use the wild, but oh well. That'll be fine. 
We take out Orange on the way to taking out South America. Gives me four more. Seven. There we go. Uh, I'm going to... Make sure we have plenty to sit here with. And that'll be a good turn. We can trade in again next time. And we can finish these guys off. Neither of them has a trade and they're fighting each other. Gotta love that. Somebody would just hit one of these and open me all the way up. That would be great. Hey, there it is. <laughs> uh, that's perfect. Are they going to hit my three? No, they're going back into Europe. Quebec would be great. No, no Quebec. Okay. All right, so we will trade that in there. All of it goes here. Next phase, we get that guy. All right, there's white. And we'll finish up with blue. All right, so we did win one, even if there was too many bots. I defeated the human players pretty easily. Uh, it's not going to put me back up to Grandmaster just yet, but apparently that was my 200th victory. That's pretty cool. So we will see how terrible these other players were. Oh, expert and intermediate. All right, so that'll actually help a little bit. Um, 24, 122. Those other games have to be over. I guess that's where I'm sitting for the moment. So until next time, uh, this is Ryan signing off with uh, Mediocre Risk.